Hello, this is Artifacts of Mars. Let me close that out. Uh, you're not going to believe this one. Uh, frankly, I don't believe this one. A Drexel University professor whose tweet that he wanted the white genocide for Christmas sparked a firestorm of criticism from the school and social media users said on Monday his comment was satirical. Oh, come on. That is bullshit. Don't try to get out of this like that. George Sikakariel-Meyer, sorry, that's not going to have happen, a white assistant professor of history and politics at the Philadelphia University posted all I want for Christmas is white genocide on Twitter and Christmas Eve, according to media reports. He followed up Sunday by tweeting to clarify when whites were massacred during the Haitian Revolution, that was a good thing indeed. Talk about a sick individual, this one takes fries. This, this one is sicker than the average liberal. There are a lot of liberals that are really that are sick, and there are some liberals who are reasonable people. This one is very sick. Condemnation lit up on Twitter after comments from CM, I'm just going to call him CM, an expert on Latin American social movements, were picked up by such conservative news sites as Breitbart, <laughs> News and Daily Caller. What rock did this cretin crawl out from under? Sean O'Reilly tweeted. Twitter users Cam's wrote, You want a white genocide? Why not be the only one who starts and see where you wind end up? You coward. That's pretty young one. Now, Drexel University, a private school of about 26,000 Students sent in a statement on Sunday, and they contacted CM to schedule a meeting about tweets. I would think so. At least it's, they have to give the school credit, at least they're saying, hey, this is wrong. Drexel said that although they recognize the right of faculty members to express their views, the, comment, the comments were utterly reprehensible, deeply disturbing, and do not in any way reflect the values of the university. Good! CM said in an email Monday that tweets were only aimed at poking fun at white supremacists and that he and Drexel had become targets of a smear campaign. What smear campaign? That is bullshit. He said the concept of white genocide was used by white nationalists to denounce everything from interracial marriage, interracial relationships to policies aimed at promoting multiple cu cultures. It's a figment of the racist imagination that should be mocked and I'm glad to have mocked it, CM wrote. According to his Twitter account, he had been restricted on Monday. Well, thank God, at least even Twitter, even Twitter is saying, hey, this is too much. He has drawn online support with a change.org petition backing him, generating almost 3,000 signatures by Monday. Let Drexel know in the midst of the deafening organized troll storm that racist trolls deserve no platform dictating academic discourse let alone the off-duty tweets of academics position sent. Uh, well, shall we go to uh, change.org? That's his, this is this idiot's page on Drexel. I don't give a shit what his skin color is. This is a moron who should be locked up. Uh, in a mental hospital. Here we go, change.org, rushing to the rescue. So, 
and right here it is, George is outspoken, witty, and fiercely anti-racist. That is a lie. You are a liar, 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 pants on fire. He is being extensively harassed as the target of a racist internet troll campaign out of Breitbart, Stephen Brannon's rag. They are harassing him in his place of employment, preserve academic freedom, and wit and intelligence and anti-racism. That is a rap lie. That's bullshit. In this nasty new era of living in the United States of internet trolls. Sport George. Let Drexel know in the midst of deafening organized troll storm that racist trolls deserve no platform in dictating academic discourse, let alone off-duty tweets of academics. They're being very noisy. We can't be silent. Well, I guess you can add me to uh, your list of trolls, you douchebags. Who wrote this? Cynthia Walker, Brooklyn, New York. Well, Cynthia, since you wrote this, you support 100% genocide against whites. You are a sick, twisted, and diseased individual, just as uh, sick as CM is. And here we get an insight into change.org. They are supporting white genocide and want to see whites wiped out. It's right here in black and white. Change.org is a genocidal organization. Genocide, genocide, genocide. These are sick, psychopathic monsters. I can't believe this is allowed to go on, to be honest with you. This has gone too far, but at least that school is doing something about it. Drexel's doing something about it, and I applaud them for that. Thank you very much. Don't know what they're going to do, but... At least something is happening with it. Besides change.org, standing up for genocide against whites, there it is. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.